提到列治文生產，但係因為初生女嬰喺母親坐月期間發生嚴重嘅健康問題，引起省兒童廳嘅關注，並且將隨行嘅六歲女兒帶走，並且係交由寄養家庭暫時照顧。喺今日，女英嘅父母同代表律師就接受英文報章省報嘅訪問，但係就拒絕接受本台記者嘅提問。吳欣欣嘅報導，女英嘅父母李氏夫婦今朝十點已經到達黃仁铎律師位於列治文嘅事務所，接受省報記者嘅訪問，但係佢哋就拒絕接受電視台嘅提問。News spread. This news can spread from one source to another, and then. But it can do the same way with a newspaper interview. 而在場嘅省報記者對夫婦拒絕接受電視訪問，亦感到詫異。根據明報喺二月一號嘅報導，本身要回流北京嘅李氏夫婦喺零八年十月帶同六歲嘅大女入住列治文一間無牌經營嘅坐月中心。太太喺十二月誕下女嬰之後就繼續喺中心坐月，直到上個月十七號，女嬰被發現身體有問題，送院後證實腦部受傷，懷疑患上搖晃嬰兒綜合症。兩人嘅大女就被省兒童廳接到寄養家庭暫住。本台亦曾到訪涉案嘅坐月中心，但係就冇人應門。该中心喺一栋独立屋内经营，并冇商业登记。类似嘅蔡月中心喺本地并唔罕见，喺互联网同报章都有刊登相关嘅广告。列治文王家骑警就表示，由于案件仲喺调查中，唔可以给予评论，但就证实有一名一个月大嘅女婴被送院留医，情况危殆。亦指骑警知道有人无牌经营蔡月中心，但系呢啲中心并唔喺骑警嘅管辖范围之内。At this point, because we've had no complaints, because we have no information to indicate any sort of illegal activity at any of these homes, uh, we can't really be doing anything. However, what we would like to, to say to the public is, you should be very careful about where you're leaving your children. 温哥華沿岸衛生局就表示，當局喺零五年曾研究過本地嘅坐月中心，但係當時就唔認為中心嘅運作有涉及日托或醫療服務，所以並唔需要登記。Just because they are charging Money for a mother or parents to stay and receive room and board, and that's where the the newborn baby is staying with the mother and or the mother and father. That doesn't mean necessarily that they would require to be licensed or regulated. 列治文市政府就話，由於並冇收到有關嘅投訴，暫時唔會對事件作出評論或調查。但係就話，未經登記而喺住宅內經營商業活動係違反市府嘅附例。基於私隱理由，卑斯兒童醫院不願透露女嬰現時嘅狀況。至於李氏夫婦嘅代表律師黃仁鐸就表示，李氏夫婦現時嘅焦點最主要希望大女可以返回父母嘅身邊。新時代電視記者吳欣欣報導。